Hey, what's going on? It's your boy So Grateful Joe here, and I'm glad to be back. Let's play a little bit of catch up while I do some little bit of housework. To catch everyone up, some of the things that happened. Number one, we moved into this big old house. Actually, it's all to myself this weekend. Thanksgiving weekend. Let's do a quick tour. Workstation, got all the stuff here. I usually do my flipping, my podcast, editing right here. Over here, some more flip items. Those are gonna have to move since Thanksgiving is tomorrow. Under the dining table, we got two door balcony up here, right? Beautiful landing right here. Upstairs to our bedrooms. Hour, by the way, moved in with some roommates. Actually, I'm gonna shoot, I'm gonna show some of the video. Oh, well, let me finish the tour. Got the living area here. You remember that food time? But I'm gonna get a little Yes, that's from my old apartment. And then these two are my roommates. They got this big old TV. I could go without that, but they like to watch TV, so we're gonna leave that there. Got a nice little window there. There's the kitchen area. Here's where the magic happens, right? As you know, me and Andrew are both, me and one of my roommates, Andrew, are very much into lifting. Blood. <laughs> <laughs> He's dying, bro. When you press for time and you didn't have any time to do cardio. <laughs> My guy! Therefore, we're always in the kitchen cooking to try to fit that nutrition portion of fitness. As you can see here, look at that. That's some of my stuff. A little bit more of my stuff right there. And look at Andrews. That's why he's, this is why he's bigger than me. Look at this stuff. This is all Andrews. Takes up like three shelves. That's some seriousness though. Okay, that's the common area. Uh, you don't really need to see the bedrooms. Those we're gonna keep somewhat discreet, but that this is the house. And let me run some of the footage of when we were actually, when they were living in another townhome and I wanted to go try to look for that. So I'm gonna do like these little flashbacks, but I think I might make the full movie because I think I had enough footage of a lot of these events, but let's go there now. All right, my people, we are here. I'm about to go inside and catch up with these fools, my two potential roommates. Well, they're most likely gonna be my roommates. Might as well introduce you to them. Well, you've met one of them. One of them you're probably, you're meeting for the first time. All right, let's get in there. Hey, yo, head honcho, I'm outside. All right, we're walking in now. What up, bro? Roommate number hey, one. Hey, what's good, bro? Yeah, yeah. yeah, you like the scoop? Yeah. <laughs> what's up, my guy? What's up, bro? So this was the potential house, Whoa. but we're gonna look for houses on the internet real quick before we take off and actually physically look at them. <laughs> Welcome back. No, as you saw, we were looking for a house and we finally found this one, luckily. Right now, I'm actually working on, I mean, the grind don't stop, right? Like I'm here working on a podcast episode right here. And yeah, for Thanksgiving tomorrow. So this is being recorded the day before Thanksgiving. And you know, I'm just, I don't wanna make excuses as to why I haven't been uploading. It just has not been a priority. I've been prioritizing the business, podcast, and just working, having to make money, make ends meet. Nobody was providing for me, I provide for myself. So I'm out here having a grind to make some money. So that kind of took the place of a lot of the time that I was spending on vlog. Granted, things could change depending on some investments. And by the way, Bitcoin is at like four grand right now. I'm still bullish. I want this to be marked in history. I said this on November, what's today? November 21st, November 21st, 2018, that I'm bullish on Bitcoin and I still believe in it. So a year from now, if it's up, you can't say that I'm a bandwagon fan or I'm a bandwagon individual because I was saying it even when things were bad, because things look bad right now, but they're gonna get better. All right, not as intense. So now I'm going through some of the footage that I have. I'm gonna give you, like I said, all those flashbacks of stuff that we missed to catch up. Again, like I said, I don't wanna make excuses. I wanna, from moving forward, I wanna be posting, I'm gonna post as much 
as I can. When I find the time to make it happen, I will upload. So it's gonna be a little sporadic. There's not gonna be a real schedule. I kind of hate having it regimented like that. It gives me more creativity, a little bit less pressure, and I don't feel like it's forced. This is a, it's, it's a basically like a video diary for me. This is a vlog for myself and maybe you can get something out of it as well. But it's also for like my kids and my grandkids. Like I said in the car, I may have mentioned this, Gary Vee talks about this all the time that, you know, even if you vlog and document just for the sake of documenting, like that's so much that you could capture to show your kids, your grandkids, your future nieces and nephews and and it's just a beautiful thing and i was watching mine the other day and it was true it really it really did feel that way to me it felt very nostalgic it gave me a lot of gratitude for my experiences therefore i'm gonna try to vlog again i'm gonna try to keep keep it going i know i can't do the daily right now i can't the daily is just not feasible because i'll have to drop everything else and i just can't right now but i will be doing it more consistently i shouldn't go two months without uploading that's for sure now we're gonna jump into let's see here you guys have seen all this. This, let's see. VidCon. Coming back from VidCon. I could delete, I really could delete all this. I don't need this. Now I'm hoarding video clips. This is all still recorded. We got all this foot. Oh, here we go. All right, so a few. So we'll show a few business meetings as well as. Oh, I already showed that, so never mind. That's not being shown. What I heard. Stand by. Okay, I found it. Okay, so I'm gonna go through a bunch of basically what's been going on is work, 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 work. A lot of podcasts. A few conferences for my company. So a couple of blockchain cryptocurrency conferences that we went to. All right, just watch the rest of this stuff and that'll get you up to speed see you on the other end all right we made it downtown here we're gonna be at the hyatt regency over here for the blockchain conference discover blockchain gonna try to document and record as much as i can for the company and for my blog so let's get it all right this is day two of discover blockchain well, actually technically this is day one so last night was the kickoff party uh, adjust my mirror. There we go. Good morning, sir. How are you? I'm all good, man. All right. Okay. I'm great. You yeah, see my text last night? I was like, should I should I uh, stay down here or come up there? And you guys are all. <laughs> oh yeah, we saw it. <laughs> hey Norm. I was just trying to What's figure up? out how you feel. What they, I'm good. How are you? I just, huh? I'm wanting some alone what? time or not? Hey, we me and me and Norm were freestyling at the bar, by the way. We were. I also forgot to mention that I got a new job. I went back to the corporate life, working for a really good company, but still, you know. But yeah, I'm working for Shell now. I'm here at my Shell job. As you saw there, also been doing a lot of yoga. Flip to that. Speaking of flip, I've also been flipping a lot of, a lot of items. Flip life. Thank you, Lisa. Okay. Okay. All these clips are coming from my Instagram story feed. If you're not following me on Instagram, what are you doing? I'm most active on Instagram. That's the platform that I use the most. I comment to every single DM, every single comment that I get. I make sure to comment and I make an effort to really maintain that one, unfortunately to the detriment of the other platforms, but still, if you want to get in touch with me, that is, aside from my cell phone, the best way to reach me. And my cell phone is 713-555-5555. You thought I was going to give you my phone number? Nah, you got to know me personally. Slide in my DMs first, take me out to dinner, then maybe you can get my number. And that honestly was a lot of the highlights, a lot of the bigger stuff that happened that I happened to capture on camera. Again, if you follow me on Instagram, you'll be much more in tune with the day-to-day -day, like action, like right there. This right here on YouTube on the vlog is edited. I go through and I find like the pieces that I like and chop them up, put music on them, flip, put my thing down, flip it and reverse it. You know what I'm saying? So if you want that real raw, follow me at So Grateful Joe on Instagram because I post a lot of stories to get a little closer to me. That's if you want to. I mean, you don't have to, but if you do, check me out again. That's at so grateful, Joe. I hope you enjoyed this episode of the vlog. There'll be much more to come. Let me get back to this vlogging, man. I missed it. I missed you guys. Comment below if you missed me. Let me know. Let me know if you're still around. I still have like 1,500 people subscribed to me, so 
let me know. Don't not don't be non-engaging, be engaging. All right, until next time. Peace, y'all.